Hey there guys, Godly Seafood here. I want to make a quick little video just in regards to, I guess, post five boxes events stuff. I know I farm that quite a lot. I want to say probably average like two to three hours of farming a day. And I didn't even farm every single day. Uh, there were a couple days, like maybe two or three days where I just didn't farm at all. Just because I was, you know, doing uh doing streams and questing streams and whatnot but i did want to show you guys kind of what i got this isn't exact i want to say i probably trashed a couple of hats a couple of robes and a couple you know maybe one or two boots and then just every other one that i got but from what i can show you as far as farming what is it the five boxes event i want to say you probably average about two to three runs per hour maybe four if you've got a really good team and you guys are just dedicated to farming it so, yeah, I want to say two to three hours on average, or sorry, two to three runs on average, and then three hours a day on average. That's probably about nine runs each day, give or take. I don't know. Maybe maybe it's looking more like three to four. But just with, I'll let you guys figure out the math on that one. Mostly because I played support, I let other people hit, and we got shit done fast. So that's always great. I'm getting, what is this? One, two, three, four... I want to say I at least trash like three hats. So seven hats on top of an eighth hat, which I did get every single piece of gear except for the energy robe. Uh, as far as boots go, I ended up getting a lot more of the uh, a lot more of the boots overall. Like what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. About six of these, and I trashed probably one or two. But yeah, I got a lot of energy boots. That's pretty cool. As far as robes go, robes were probably the least that I got. I want to say... Actually, I don't even think I have any inside of here. That is because I made some mannequins. And then I got one of each of the wands, so I just decided, eh, fuck it, I'd throw them up somewhere. But the wands suck, so I'm not counting those as good drops. On top of all of that that you saw, I've now got, you know, a full set of the brilliant armor, full set of the peaceful armor, and... Boom, I've got basically one piece away from the full energetic armor, which is awesome. I actually like these guys. I might use these for life stitches, like if I ever want to make a life character and look like Groot. And then let's see if I can find... I actually just redid my teleporter network to because I just got the Arcanum apartment. So aside from the Desert Villa, all of my houses have teleporters to all of the other houses... So if I go to my myth house, just kind of like my main hub area with crafting and shit. Uh, where did I put the wands? I put them somewhere. Hold up. Okay, here we go. Apparently, I didn't actually put them in my myth house. I put them in my, my regular house. So, you know, as you can see, got the energetic staff, brilliant staff, and peaceful staff. So, yeah, I managed to get every single piece of armor uh, except for the energetic robe. I also ended up getting... The, uh, oh, what are they called? The little butterfly wand, uh, not wands, the butterfly, uh, mounts. I think I got them over here with all my fucking bone dragons from farming the, uh, the Lost Pages event. I got a bunch of these, but I'm only keeping one. I don't know where I got this from, but yeah. Also got both of these permanent, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, as far as running it, I probably want to say... I did at least two to three runs per hour for three hours for every day that it was out. So let's, let me do the math on that real quick. All right, so I'm an idiot. I was looking around trying to find something on the internet that showed when they came out. And then I remembered, oh yeah, I did a video on each one like the day that it came out. So yeah, I, I think it came out on June 13th. It's currently the last day to farm it was June 26th. So what was that? 13 days. And then I want to say... Probably like three of those days I didn't even farm, so... Yeah, I think the math works out to right around like 90 runs. Maybe 100 if I happen to go like super fast on some of them, but... Yeah, for the most part, I don't think the five boxes event was too difficult. Uh, obviously, it was made back in the era where level like 80 was the cap and shit. But it was a lot of fun. There's a lot of interesting lore stuff. One too many plot holes for my, my interest, but for the most part, it was a fun event and... Yeah, you, you can definitely get drops. You just got to farm it. There are a lot of 
there were a lot of runs where you would just get nothing but mounts like blue fairy wings or socket springs or the fucking energetic staffs and whatnot like i i trash a ton of these i'm not even counting these as drops nor the mounts because they're just super easy to get but yeah for the most part it was it was a lot of fun also i did manage to save at least the most important valuable treasure and that is i bought the young cyrus painting nice and i can make at least 27 of them let's go No, I keep fizzling.